Howdy, Cowboy Gamer here again, and I'm still running this Typlusion deck. Uh, I am making slight tweaks. Um, I'm I, I'm still trying to get these uh, rare candies, but since I can't, I'm throwing in two Eve sodas. This pretty much allows me to evolve, so if I don't get the rare candy, it just lets me, if I have the Cyndaquil, go to his next evolution, or if I have that, go to Typlusion really easily. Um, I drop down a Heavy Ball. Ultra Ball still does the exact same thing, and really Heavy Ball is just more useful if you're running rare candies. Um, since I still haven't been able to trade for another, I'm not too down with this. Um, before I did throw in the Max Potion, uh, just because usually you get only one Typlusion out, if someone does some damage and gets out another Pokemon and is able to build it up, they can hit another one. So that's kind of my problem with it. Um, and one, since I only need one energy to make it work, I'm going to draw into it. I dropped out another Sycamore, um, mostly because you don't really need to draw too much. You can hit these, and with Skyla, um, you're searching for all this stuff. You really don't need Sycamores in here, uh, but every once in a while, I get it's nice to just discard my hand, hit another Cyndaquil, hit another upgraded or a rare, um, especially when I Ultra Ball a lot to get out stuff. But uh, let's do a versus match, and let's play with this. Um, again, I love this whole thing about gaining rewards, uh, making me really happy. I am working on trading off a bunch of stuff to make uh, another deck I've been working on. It's kind of my own little... Uh, it's something that I thought I kind of came up with. I have notice now that a few people have been playing um, something like this or using the abilities and the kind of idea but not using um, the Pokemon all the Pokemon I'm using um, I've actually found that it's better with this deck to go second so that allows me to attack immediately um, this isn't bad um, Usually, this is pretty impressive considering I only have four basics. Um, the fact that I can start this off is great. Again, this guy isn't running water that I know, but um, this could be really useful. Now, I have the choice to... I think I'm going to Ultra Ball and get rid of this. I'm going to find another uh, Cyndaquil. Uh, maybe not. I think I go... It's a tough one. Uh... Yes, next turn I can go straight into that anyway. Um, yeah, that's fine. I'll do this. This allows me to see if he starts building up the energy, if I want to Eve Soda onto him. Okay, so he's making it difficult for me to do stuff with it. That's fine. Uh, let's do that. Let's upgrade that. That ends my turn. However... I think I'm going to hold this energy. I'm not going to attack, because he'll get the lucky, but I will Typlusion him, and he'll only draw two cards. He also is not building any of these up at the moment, which is good. Chespin's not so great, but now he's starting to. I should be able to one-shot him at, at next turn, so he can't kill me. And he's going to put a bunch of stuff on the bench, so it allows him to um, get going. He'll draw a few more cards out of this, but that's not as pretty. Those are nice. So we are going to do that. And we're going to save the energy still, because if I need to, I'm going to throw it over there. But I want to get this killed. Wow. That almost never happens.
blows my mind. However, I never would have had enough to get the 130 anyway. Just usually I hit one. So we're going to see. He's probably going to start getting either of these built up. Probably the main electric. However, he is low on energy. Um, that can be really useful. I am going to... Nope, can't ultra. Um, 36 cards. Um, I actually have to throw the energy on him. Uh, mostly because I need to actually start building energy disruption. Now he hasn't had energy yet for some reason, so we'll see who he puts out to that. That's okay, but... I'm not gonna use, I'm gonna use my basic attack because one land kills it. Um, I also, I like putting this because if he starts putting energy and I get a Lysander, I can start disrupting his energy. Um, at the same time, I really want to Ultra Ball and get rid of this Cyndaquil and this and get the uh, next variation. All right, he has double color list. That's not cool. Um, I think I'm still going to run this. Uh, one is plenty. It's also weak, so this gives me something. Now I can Ultra Ball and get rid of those for the next version, so I can start building up another type Lucian in case he gets any of these online, which is what I'm worried about. I'm really not too worried about this. This can do some good damage, but it's still only about 160 at best if he really gets it going. Now he's going to try and get rid of his hand because he needs energy. That's where he's hitting. Also, he's screwing with mine. Um, but I'm not completely horribly worried about this. Again, one card is enough. Deep Soda is good. It'll allow me to evolve. Now he's bringing this out. Um, it's going to take less damage. However, I can disrupt him. And I don't think he can kill me right away. He's going for something in here. Uh, again, I'm losing cards pretty quick in this deck. I'm already down to 21 and I'm losing 5 each turn. 70, I'm fine with. Also, I'm not paralyzed. Um, let's do this. Let's... Oh, that's not good. This takes 20 less, it doesn't have weaknesses, and if I disrupt... If I discard an energy... That's technically, I think I'm right with that. Um, however, I don't kill it. I think I just go for uh, 160 and hope to hit two cards. There we go. Kills that. Now he is so running out of cards. And whatever he brings up, if I need to, I can Lysander it. Oh, he is going for... Does 120. So he can kill me. Um, this stinks a little bit. I was not prepared, but... Oh well, it is what it is. I really don't have much of a choice, however... I can... throw that up for... Forty. 
cheap retreat cost, cheap retreat cost. This is not a cheap retreat cost. And it's not super easy to get going. Um, let's throw another energy on that. And let's hit for 60. I'm fine with that. Now I can toy with him. I still have chances of losing because neither of these are coming and I have no, and I repeat, no, um, uh, none of my uh, next Pokemon. So I literally have to hit. Oh, and I have no rare candies. So literally I can't. I have to hit my Quivla, and I've lost one, two, three. I have one more in here. Three damage on it. Um, also, is not gonna kill it. I have to dig. Yep, it's gonna hurt me. Also, it's going to kill me next turn if um, he gets anything online. I'm really in horrible straits. I will probably lose to this guy. He's playing just the delay game, which is understandable, and he's healing. So yeah, he's delaying, and if he delays long enough, he's going to keep drawing cards. But he literally can't retreat easily, and if I can kill him... Uh, that goes into play, gets the energies, and can come into play and kill me immediately. That works really well. Well, I'm going to Skyla. Also, I'm going to do this. Wow. Literally, my last two cards are my vinyl variations. Okay. Things for me puts me in a bad place. I will lose no matter what. Um, sadly, it is what it is. He's going to win because I will draw out, unfortunately. I got a good start, but yeah. Um, this will give him another turn to come up. And if he can heal again, got it. So, not the greatest of game, especially with the break. That really hurts. He's really building it up. Too bad. I got him close. Now he'll put energies in his hand. He'll attach, I think, a green, and he'll drop Dragonite, put all the energies on it, and move it into place, and attack for the win. Or not. Maybe I don't know what's going on. I'm still just going to play this out. I know I can't get anything and I've lost as soon as I attack again, but... Yep, at 190. I, I can't kill him. Oh, wait. Oh, no. A heal helps. I thought for some reason a uh, break card count is two, but it doesn't. It's just DX. Kills me right here. It's it was a good it was a good play. It was a good good game. Uh, having a lot of not EX Pokemon hurt me a bit. Um, also, I did not expect that one to really do so well. But eh, you win some, you lose some. I'm still primarily winning with this deck, and it was quick and easy to make. So. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will catch you guys next game.